fastest Toyota Corolla in the world. Launched this week in Belgium, Team Toyota Europe's new World Rally car is set to take over from the twice World Championship winning Celica. To make its debut next month in the Rally of Finland in the hands of former world champion Didier Oriol, the Corolla will come down under in force this November for Rally Australia. Its drivers? Well, one will be Oriol, and another, a man not unknown to many Australians. I'm very, you know, happy that we can give this chance to Tunil in Australia, because also Toyota Australia has always been very supportive to us. Three times Australian champion Neil Bates was in the Brussels Chateau for the launch, but it was still some sort of shock to be named in front of 300 of the world's media. Ah, oh, obviously I'm absolutely over the moon about it. Uh, uh, the car looks absolutely great and and uh, from all reports it performs really well so so i'm looking forward to it immensely bates new corolla gives an australian their best shot ever at winning rally australia an event usually dominated by the very top level of european professionals it'll definitely be a, a full-on drive where i'll just be part of tte and, and just turn up and drive the car so so obviously I'm looking forward to that and the part I'm most looking forward to is there's quite a bit of testing beforehand so I'll be looking forward to that to become familiar with the Corolla and, and hope to get on the pace in the car. The new Corolla is quick right out of the box. Limited by regulations to 300 horsepower, its 2 litre turbocharged engine nonetheless develops more than 500 newton metres of torque. It puts all that power to the ground through four wheel drive flowing through this Formula One style six speed sequential gearbox. I don't think before now that we would have been ready for what's happening now, so it's just just through what's been happening with Australian rallying and, and it's now that Australian rallying has got to a level where we're competing in world championship cars and hopefully close to world championship pace. The big news is that after Rally Australia, Bates is likely to keep his car. It's a huge fillip for next year's Australian Rally Championship and for Bates, who may also campaign the car in selected rounds of the Asia-Pacific Championship. But the even bigger news is that Rally Australia could be a turning point in the career of Neil Bates. Team Toyota Europe is recruiting. Now, Marcus, we have Freddie, we have Neil Bates, we have, you know, some young guys and may maybe there is a possibility. I'm, Personally, I'm always looking for that because, yeah, we need the old drivers, but we also need the young, the young and upcoming guys that put some new spirit into the, to the sport. Neil Bates has flown straight from Brussels to Auckland this weekend to practice for next week's World Rally Championship round, Rally New Zealand. Bates has the honour of giving Celica its swan song drive in a world title, and as one of the first to rally the new Corolla, his stocks are on the rise. I won three Australian championships in a in a sleeker and uh, but you know looking here at the Corolla it's hard not to be excited about the Corolla and, and it's a very exciting looking car and, and I just can't wait to get in.